I'm here on the Audio Technica stand with Gary Boss to talk about a new microphone in the 50 series uh, range, which was uh, a rectangular diaphragm, doesn't it? That's correct. And I'd, I'd like to say, first of all, that we're very excited to introduce this uh, microphone because we had a 50 series with only one mic in it, and I think series is plural. So now we actually Absolutely. truly have a series, so we're very excited. Yeah, the, the, the 5045 is, is brand new, and it's a very proprietary capsule. So mm -hmm. for those people who are familiar with the 5040, which was a very unique microphone in itself, it did have four rectangular capsules, which are in no way related to this. This is a completely new proprietary capsule. So right. the actual size of this capsule is much larger than any of the individual. In fact, this is oh, okay. our largest manufacturable surface area capsule. This is about, this, this single diaphragm is about one and a half times the size of our next largest diaphragm, which is a 46 year 4047. Right, so, okay. Very large diaphragm. Sure, sure. Um, a couple things that we did, the reason we did the rectangular capsule, there are certain limits. Once you get a capsule size a certain diameter, yeah. The uh, excursion of the, the material actually causes it to begin to hit the back plate of the microphone. Yes. So you have to start increasing that gap, and there's a lot of things that are compromised about the performance of the microphone when you increase that gap to get that away from the back plate. Yes. So by doing the rectangular capsule, we can keep that uh, diaphragm much closer to the back plate. We get okay. things like a much faster transient response, yep. uh, more sensitivity out of the microphone. So really what we're doing here is we're combining a similar philosophy which we had with the 5040 was to get large diaphragm and uh, small diaphragm characteristics in a single microphone. So sure. for instance, large diaphragm characteristic of this microphone is it's a reasonably warm microphone. Mm -hmm. It also has a very low noise floor of only 8 dB. Okay? Right. Uh, small diaphragm characteristics, it's a very fast microphone. The transients are very quick on this microphone. Yeah. Um, with no pad, no roll off in the circuit, you know, we wanted to keep this purity of audio kind of uh, overlying philosophy with this microphone. It still will do 149 dB of max SPL. Right. If you do the calculation, 8 dB noise for that's 141 dB of dynamic range on this microphone. It's pretty huge, isn't it? It's uh, the highest that I've been able to see in my internet, my exhaustive internet search. <laughs> I cannot find a manufacturer that has done a dynamic range like that in a microphone. So right. We're very excited about that, but what we're more excited is to introduce another very high quality microphone into the 50 series with a very different purpose. This was primarily a vocal microphone. Yeah. The 5045 is primarily an instrument microphone. That's not to say you couldn't sing into it because mm -hmm. it makes amazing vocal mic, but for drum overheads, for strings, for uh, very articulate sounds. Yeah. This, this microphone really excels, especially with that dynamic range. You could use it for guitar cabinets, sure. pretty much anything in the studio. Okay, and it's got a, a really intriguing uh, mounting system. Yeah, so on the 5045, we had, you know, we got almost as much press on the shock mount as we did on the microphone, because they were both re very revolutionary. Well, yes. on the 5045, we have a similar thing, but because this is an instrument microphone, we went with an isolation mount rather than the traditional shock mount. Yeah. So by isolation mount, what I mean, this is more of a rigid mount, but that being said, we use rubber O-rings to decouple the microphone from the mount itself. Yeah. And then this microphone, the capsule and the circuit are complete monoblock assembly. They're not even uh, rigidly connected to the XLR. Okay. And that's suspended with rubber grommets and floats. So the whole that's assembly floats within the microphone itself. So right. the need for the shock mount is not as necessary. And with this kind of an isolation mount, now I can get in closer to say a guitar cabinet sure. or whatever. It's a little more usable as an instrument microphone. Yeah. So Good. we have two two versions of this available. We have the uh, AT4040, uh, 5045, which is the single mic, and that comes in a rigid case with mm -hmm. an isolation mount and a foam windscreen. Right. Or we have the AT5045 SP for pair, stereo pair. Right, okay, stereo pair. And uh, so we actually have two in a box. Okay, so. great. Um, shipping and price, please. Uh, shipping will happen within the next couple weeks. Okay. And US street price for a single mic with all the uh, named accoutrements yep. uh, will be $13.99 and a pair will be $24.99. Brilliant. Lovely. Thank you yeah. very much indeed. Hey, thank you so much for stopping. Thanks.